Hello guys, Natwais here and I just want to put this video as soon as possible. It is an, sort of an MMVGV vlog and it's going to be in my main channel and the second channel. So why all this hubbubble? Well, if you've been following Nintendo, I think hours ago, the Nintendo of America basically made a sad news that, well, the NES Mini Collection, the plug-and-play Mini NES, they're now discontinued. It's officially discontinued. There's a press release from Nintendo saying, yeah, we're discontinued production, and there's the last batch, and whatever you can get it, that's it. And, you know, it's kind of sad. I mean, it's so sad that there was a good Nintendo Direct yesterday, and I'll be talking about that in a different vlog, and it was really awesome. Then you have this bad news coming the next day. And you might be saying, wait, wait, why would you do that? People still want that. There's like the demand, it's not even reaching the supplies yet. Like, I still want one. Hey, I never even got one. I wanted to get it for 60 bucks, but I'm not gonna go stand in line in the cold just to get one. I I, I mean, I got friends who bought it for $200. I mean, yeah. So according to Nintendo, they are well aware that a lot of people wanted that the demand is very, very high. But at the same time, they just said, you know what? Well, they said it trying to be professional or PR talk, but lamest term is, they just said, tough shit. If you didn't get one, well, sucks to be you. <laughs> That's what it is, what it is, what it meant. I know you're trying to say it nice, but that is what it is. Tough shit. There you go. Yeah, they, they basically said they are well aware, but because apparently now they're saying also, well, the Nini Annie's collection wasn't really meant to be a long-term thing. It was just something to keep people busy until the Switch. Okay, I kind of get it, but why didn't you make a lot? Why you said people couldn't pre-order? And I mean, I did talk about this before, that I think they were so pessimistic, what if it doesn't sell? Oh, now it sells, people are going crazy, they're happy, but now they're saying, hey, you know, you know, we're not gonna do it anymore, we're done, uh, too bad. Again, like, why would Nintendo do it? Well. I think my only one of my theories probably they're not really making a lot of money from those mini NES and since the switch is already out they probably say hey, you know what we're making enough money we don't really need this console anymore I know a lot of people want it I want one but then they just said you know what it's time to move on so for those people you know tough luck so I mean kind of sad that I'm surprised Nintendo would go to this direction like they would actually go I was afraid that they would go I guess it's true now they are they're well aware and they don't give a shit about it. Excuse the language. I mean, the funny thing, they almost did this with the Amiibo, believe it or not. Especially when the first release in 2014. Like, there was a rumor that the Lady Water Basic also plan was that, yeah, we're going to do limited production on Mart, We Fit Trainer, and Villager. And when they're gone, we're done. We're not going to do more. But somehow some changes some strategy wasn't talking i guess kirishima trying to rectify it and he did but sadly i don't know if kirishima can rectify this it kind of disappointed me and i thought kirishima was doing the opposite what the lady water does to some extent but i guess not in the case of the mini NES. probably they're not making any money about it so it kind of sucks it really really kind of sucks here it kind of shows it's all about business. I mean, it is about business, but it also shows that the Nintendo, very sadly, are spitting on the fans who basically gave them money, who supported them, who stick with them with the Wii U, gave them the middle finger, basically to some extent, disrespecting the fans. That's what I see. I mean, am I going to boycott Nintendo? I'm going to say, oh, Nintendo's a shit. No, not really, because, you know, there's still Amiibo coming out, some new games. Of course, I'm going to buy them, but. I'm disappointed that they went to this approach with the mini NES. So, yeah, I don't know what to say about it. It sucks, in my opinion, but I guess it is what it is. So, yeah, so with that, that's my thoughts about it. Uh, like I said, I wanted to just let it all out because it is something that's sort of a big deal, especially in the Nintendo community. And if you really want this, now you're out of luck. So, with that, thanks for listening.